Does an aspirin a day really keep the doctor away? Some studies show there are benefits beyond pain relief gained by taking low-dose aspirin daily. But should you start an aspirin a day regimen if you're healthy? That's a good question. Uh, first of all, if the person's active, a non-smoker, no f family history of premature coronary disease before age 60, uh, probably doesn't need it. But if they're diabetic, they have hypertension or high blood pressure, uh, certainly if they have any vascular disease, men over 50 and women over 60 need to be on daily aspirin therapy. That's primary prevention. That's prevent problems down the line. And keep in mind there are risks involved with taking aspirin. There's a long list of possible side effects associated with aspirin consumption. The question when you always take medication, you wonder about long term, are you going to have complications from it? And the answer estimate of a, a bleed in your head or cerebral hemorrhage is about 1 in 10,000 for people to take aspirin therapy. Not everybody can take an aspirin daily because of GI issues is the big problem. They're intolerant of it or they're allergic to aspirin. I mean, occasionally persons intolerant to aspirin. So the answer as to whether to take aspirin daily is not a universal yes or no. You need medical expertise to help you determine if it's right for you. Before you take any medication, you should Consult with your physician. If you have a cardiologist, I'm sure that this will come up, but even a family practice or a general internist probably ought to have this discussion if you're in your 50s, certainly for a man, and a woman probably in her 60s.